just all the commotion with people around and stuff. This little so dog's name is Philly. Just how did Philly end up in his current situation? Well, he started out at Temple's College of Engineering. His commander called me and said, hey, uh, can you go and take a look at this dog that they found wandering around the building? And he wasn't snapping or growling enough, and I was very friendly. Uh, you could barely see his face because he was just covered all with hair. Um, I took a picture of him, I sent a text to my wife, and I was like, hey, I'm look at our new addition. And she was like, are you going to bring him home? First, Philly was held at the animal shelter for 48 hours. Facial recognition software confirmed it. Nobody was looking for him, so they called Sergeant Ramos. Came in and uh, did a meet with his family, made sure that it was a good fit all around, and, and gave him a home, which is, which is great. I mean, it can't go better than that. If you're ready to be a hero like Sergeant Ramos and welcome one of these little guys into your home, go to acctphilly.org. But remember, it is a commitment. If you're going to adopt, make sure you're ready to. Um, and if you don't want to, that's, that doesn't make it a bad thing. You can still make a huge difference and save a life and have the companionship of an animal by fostering. Act Philly is always looking for volunteers. Go to templeupdate.com for more info on how you can get involved. For Temple Update, I'm Stacy Landrum.